lovely people. Welcome back. Thank you for coming back and come over here real quick and join me for a little craft and a little cocktail. Today my cocktail is a margarita. I was craving a margarita and I thought, you know what? I'm tired of working. I'm going to come over here and I'm going to have some fun. So uh, I've got this silly little project today and I was already started on this and I thought, you know, I better show this off. So anyway, but before I go on, I want to do a shout out to the Frontiers Man. Uh, it's the Frontiers Man Travel and Adventure. Let me tell you something, he's sipping on whiskey, he knows his whiskey, and I don't know a lot about whiskey, so I'm trying to learn a little bit. I wanna, you know, I stay to Crown. You know, I drink Crown, maybe a little Jack Daniels. Jack Daniels is a little strong for me. I don't do very well with it. I get the bitter beer face, so that's not good throughout the whole night, you know, when you're just making faces, you know. So anyway, but check him out, the Frontiers Man Travel and Adventure. And let me tell you guys, he's as smooth as that whiskey drink. That's how you got that beautiful wife. So him and his wife, they go all over and they're in the mountains of, you know, they're over by uh, Virginia. I want to say West Virginia, but his newest video is in uh, North Dakota or South Dakota. I want to say, oh, I can't remember because to me, you know, all the way down here in Texas, they're, they're the same. But anyway, so beautiful. Oh my gosh. I've never seen mountains and trees like that. I'm in the flatlands, you know, I'm over here by the chemical alley. Oh. It's, it's awful. You know, I'm in Texas. I'm, I'm over here by Galveston. So anyway, but real quick. Oh, and my, my vintage glass is um, a, just a 1972 highball Santa glass. And these are my mom's and I have the whole set. And I really like them because they're tall and they're thin and I kind of, they look kind of modern. I kind of like them. So, mm, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's a good, I just made a margarita on the rocks. I didn't want to freeze it, you know, I was like, I'm not doing the blender thing. I thought, I'm just doing the little thing. So cheers, guys. And this is so easy, you're not gonna believe it. The first little project is just a little hint on how to make a pillar pretty tall, a tall uh, glass pillar. And I saw these at a restaurant and they were tall and I wanted to buy one and I thought, you know, I looked around, they were like $35, $30 and I thought, you know, I think I can make one. You know how I am. I'm like, I think I can make this. So anyway, this is a little shortcut, a little cheating shortcut. All you're going to do is you're going to get two vases from the dollar store. These are two vases. You're just going to, whoops. I didn't have them taped together. You're just gonna put whatever you want on the bottom. You don't have to put anything if you don't want to. You could just make these clear. That would be very beautiful too. So all I did was I stacked them, I added some little ornaments, and I'm gonna tape them together. And that's it. And then I'm gonna decorate it the way I want. So, so you know, you, you know, you kind of hide this a little bit, and you're gonna hide this tape anyway, so it's no big deal. I think I like this tape better. Yeah, so this is the easiest way to go along the side, up and down and then wrap it, then wrap it. And like I tell you, I kept looking at these at this restaurant and I thought, I want those on my table. I thought, I wanna make those. And I thought, I don't wanna spend $35 on a, on a tall glass pillar. I thought, this is ridiculous. So I decided to make them my, you know, make them on my own. Just dollar store stuff, wrap that really good. And if you have something a little, you know, a little weight on the bottom, that might help a little bit in case you're gonna add a big candle in there like I am. But that's it. This is a first little simple project, guys. I just, I was going through it real quick and I thought, I think I'm gonna show them. Not that you like this or anything, but if this, you know, if you're looking to decorate, this might, this might help you out a little bit. And then you're just gonna get this and you're just gonna hide this. You're gonna hide your tape. So let me see if I can, whoops, let's see which one I was dealing with. I think I was already over here. I think I had bent that a little bit just to help me out. And that's, that's my hiding right there. I'm just gonna hide that. Let's see, did I do it this way? Yeah. Now I'm all confused. Now I'm all confused. Look at me, look at me. Okay, okay. That's what I'm gonna do. I should have brought something to hold that real quick, but I'm just gonna, I'm gonna twirl that around and I'm gonna hide that real quick and I'm gonna tape that, guys. And then I'm just gonna tie it on. I'm just gonna tie it on. So this is just a simple one. This is a simple one. This isn't the main project. This is just something I was showing you. Let me, okay, let me tie that to there. Okay, and then I think my music's too loud. Okay, oh, I really like it, guys. I really like it. I don't know if you can see that. And you know, I'm gonna have two of these. I'm gonna put two on my table. I like the way they look. I'm gonna kind of gather it over here in the corner. Okay, 
And then I'm gonna gather this on top and I'm gonna add my candle. This is gonna be so easy, guys. And I have a wire, I have a wire, so. so. And this is just old garland, guys, that I had in the garage or something, who knows? Who knows where I get my stuff? Or I just happen to have it, wait, wait, didn't do that right? Well, that's an epic fail. <laughs> oh, but here we go, here we go. Much better, much better, okay. So trim that up, and then you're gonna trim it with some ribbon, and okay. And then I'm gonna add my candle, Here's my candle, add that to the top of that. And then you can already tell my other little project I'm gonna be working on. And then get your ribbon, guys. Get your ribbon, if you want green, if you want gold. I like gold, you know, I can't help it. That's just me. Let's see. And you don't have to tie it in a bow if you don't want to. You can even double it a little bit. I just thought this was so pretty. I thought, I've gotta, I've gotta do this. I thought, I've gotta do this. This is just too easy. I don't even think I'm gonna tie it in a bow. I think I'm just gonna and I'm just gonna wrap it around my finger just to let it drop a little bit, and I'll show you in one minute. Well, maybe I will tighten a bow. Yeah, guess I will. Guess I will. Okay. That is just so pretty. I really like that. Okay, I don't know if you can see that. Did I do that too tall? I know my, my video is not too great, so that's the way it looks. I don't know if you can see that. I kind of like that. I'll show it in my picture back here. So that's just one simple project, guys, because I was doing this and I thought I'd show you, but that's not the main project. The main project, we're gonna get our little whiskey bottles, the little airline whiskey bottles. That's gonna be the fun project today. And all you're gonna do is you're gonna coat these in glitter. When I thought about this, I couldn't believe I did. I, I've never done these before. And all of a sudden I was about to throw all these away and I thought, you know, I've got all these little empties. I keep saving them. What am I saving these for? Sometimes I'll refill them so we can just take them on the road, you know, to go to another casino or something. No way. I thought this is the project today. This is so easy. All you're gonna do is you're gonna coat it in glue and you're gonna sprinkle something on it. You're gonna tie a ribbon around it and you're gonna add it to whatever you want. I have a wreath and I was thinking about my Christmas presents and I can personalize them. I can put a little bee on here for my friend Bunny because it's her birthday and you know, she just had her birthday and I haven't met her yet to give her gifts. But okay, where's my glue? Here's my glue. And let me get my bottle that had this. Guys, this is so neat. I love this idea. And this wreath is gonna be for my bar. You know, I'm not putting it on the front door like, oh, look at that crazy person, you know. But I just love it. Look how easy. Use a Q-tip, coat your little bottle, coat your little bottle all the way around. And, and you don't, you know, I didn't wanna do the cap. You can if you want to. I didn't want to, but you know, it's up to you. Get your glitter, and I noticed the bigger glitter works better. This little shimmery glitter doesn't work as good. This does. I just love this. This is so easy. And you coat this according to what you want. And you know, you buy these whole packs right here for like, you know, two for a dollar or something. So that's to get you started, guys. So I don't know if you like it. You can tie a ribbon. You can add a ribbon. And I think these make good gift toppers as a special little ornament on top of a gift. But if you don't wanna do that, you can decorate your tree and you can make a bar wreath like me. You know, I got a bar. I'm gonna put my wreath on, you know, right in the middle there, right in the middle of that room because I got the little Hawaiian room. And let me show you, I've got these already done. I just love these. I just loved them when I, I started doing them this morning. Here's another little one right here. And it's so funny, because remember during the COVID deals, the takeout, we would go get uh, Mexican food and we'd order margarita and they wouldn't mix the margarita. They'd give you these little bottles on top. And I thought, you know, I'm gonna save these. I'm gonna make something. But here's the little personalized one. Oh, and guys, I used the clear, just because I didn't want to see all the white on the, but this is sold at any grocery store now, the Elmer's Clear, I love it, I love it. I don't know what took them so long, but you know, it did, it took them a while. So here's the little B, and they sell these guys at Michael's, these letters, I think they're a dollar, two dollars. But look at that, you could personalize, personalize a little ornament, yay! I like it, so I'll let that dry. And then what I do with my wire, here's my wire. And here's my wreath. Don't laugh. The only wreath I could find. 
<laughs> was my was my peace wreath and I know everyone's gonna be like ah oh, she's crazy but anyway this is my little peace wreath that I always have on my door or whatever hey peace and love right so anyway and I thought you know I'm gonna add this to my bar this year I thought I already had that out and guys I'm just gonna I'm just gonna twist these with a little bit of wire I'm gonna add my bottles to them because I thought hey there's nothing better than peace and love than being than, than being drunk too right <laughs> But I liked it. I'm gonna add some ornaments to it. I think it's gonna be really nice and festive. And you know, for New Year's, it's even neater. But I like the bow on here. And I wish I had a black bow because I thought that would be like a little bow tie. But guys, these are easy and they're cute. Whoops. They're easy, they're cute. And, and you know, everybody's got this stuff at home. And if you don't wanna do this, I thought it would be even, even cuter if you trimmed a wine bottle along the bottom or a whiskey bottle and you added lights to your bottle with the glitter. I just thought, you know, I was thinking about all that today and I was like, man, that would be so neat. So real quick, let me see if I can tie this off. Whoops, let me see if I can tie this off real quick. Okay, where are you? Where are you, where are you? Okay, well, did I make that big enough? I've got too much frill around here that I can't see what I'm doing. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, so there's two. Look how pretty that looks. So what I'm gonna do, guys, I'm gonna arrange them. I'm gonna put maybe one more right here, one more right here, another one right here. You know, and I just like the way it looks, you know, and if you have a green wreath or whatever, anything works. So, you know, don't go, don't go spend a lot of money. Everybody's got this stuff at home. So use what you have, and this video is no big deal. I just wanted to show you something, another idea for Christmas. Thank you very much for stopping by, and cheers, everybody. And check out the Frontiersman Travel and Adventure, okay? Take care and have a great week. Bye.